Hello, my wildlings, and welcome to Turnabout in the Fast Lane. This is the next part in the Zootopia Defense 2 series. Uh, the last one, well, we found out about uh, a group known as the Purists, who don't seem to like interspecies relationships and honestly don't seem like the nicest of people. Uh... And in this episode, I mean, I don't know. There's Mayor Swinton, a car. Uh, uh, well, yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. <laughs> Turn about in the fast lane. Start. Oh, this is going to be very loud in my ears. It always is. Oh, it is. Ow. And strike. Yippee! Score one to Athena. Oh, nice arm there, Gadgets. You're not too shabby at this. Oh, thanks, Nick. But really, if I can throw a cop across the street, I can throw a ball any day. Yeah. Wait, what? I guess it wasn't... So bad? That's his voice. There we go. Uh, yeah, thanks. So, how are you holding up? It's been two months since the, we arrived in Zootopia, and it's been a blast. I've made a bunch of new friends, and they've been showing me the sights. Like tonight, we decided to go bowling. Though there was an ulterior motive. Flash Slothmore, he was dumped today by his girlfriend. Poor guy's taking it hard, so we're trying to cheer him up. Uh, oh, did I have a voice for Finnick? I probably did. But let's just see what happens this time. He'll be fine, just let him be. Are you sure? I can feel his heart crying. I'm not sure what's with you in this heart stuff, but I'm sure. You just need some time, that's all. Oh well, that's the whole reason we're out here, remember? I keep accidentally right-clicking. Also, he can forget Daisy. Also, he can forget Daisy for a while, yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, because this is from Athena's perspective now, I'm going to... It's going to take me a minute to get this down right, because I'm just going to keep slipping back into Nick slash Apollo slash... Nick's voice. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> a lot of people sound the same, and I apologise. I'm not so sure it's working, though. His heart certainly isn't in the game. It was harsh of the girl to dump him over the phone, of all things. You'd think Swinton would have had, would have at least given him the time of day to say it in person. Oh, it's Mayor Swinton. Okay. <laughs> this is why I don't bother with that stuff. Oh, not for lacking lack of trying, eh, pal? Shut it, Nick. Oh, you do have a point, though. It was kind of harsh. Did she even say why she was dumping him? She did not say. I don't know what I did wrong. Oh, his slow talk makes it even sadder. Oh, well, you know what they say. Plenty more fish in the sea. Fish aren't sentient here, right? No, they wouldn't have a fish market otherwise. This place is so cool, yet so weird. The same goes for all the people I've been introduced to. Obviously there's Nick, I met him pretty early on. He's since gone on to refer to me as Gadgets, thanks to Widget. Uh, but he also he's also given nicknames to Apollo, the boss, Clavia, and even his own fiance, so I don't mind. And then there's Nick's friend, Finnick Fox. Apparently, he was one of the bo- <laughs> This is a terrible time to find out that I'm allergic to everything with fur. 
but apparently he was one of the boss's clients from way back when. Something about an arson. I really should dig for more details on that. And then there's this cheery cheetah. I like him. He's funny and his heart just screams with constant joy. Unlike flashes. I hope for Nick's right. Just pass me another one of those drinks. You've been drinking a fair few of those. You might want to take it easy. Just pass it over. I hope he doesn't inadvertently get himself hurt. Ah, don't look so worried, Gadgets. He's got us to keep an eye on him. Oh no, I, I feel like I know where this is going. Why would you hurt him twice? Why would you do this? Actually, you haven't done anything yet. Well, you've hurt him once. Well, I suppose you did. You know what I mean. Just don't. Just if you're doing what I think you're doing, please don't. I uh, wish I could tune his pain out, though. It's deafening. That ability to feel people's emotion to that ability to feel people's emotions is weird. Just to let you know. Oh, just take your turn. Already did, if you were paying attention. I'm afraid you're no longer in the lead. Huh? Oh, it's on. Gah! My precious lead! I'm afraid you're going to have to try a bit harder than that. I'll get you yet. Just you wait. <laughs> Good luck. Oh, it is on. <laughs> well, well, isn't someone competitive today? Ugh, all the voices, they're gone. They're jumbled. I'm sorry. My money's on Nick. I'll take that bet. Go, Athena! You betcha, Ben. Oh, I wouldn't act so confident. I'll show you and Nick stand back. Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> Thank you. Now prepare to eat your words. I lost. Oh, dear. <laughs> but despite that crushing blow, it was a fun night. Though Flash in the end didn't take it too easy. Oh, no. A few drinks later and he was completely blackout drunk. So when all was said and done, we had to get him home. Finnick volunteered for the task. So while he dragged Flash away, the rest of us went home for the night. Little did I know that later that night, things would take a turn for the worst. Oh good, question marks. That's always a good sign. There, that's... I don't know. Let it never be said that Daisy... Daisy Swinter, manager of the DMV... No, oh. oh, but I'd better get home. I need some sleep. Oh, it's not Maya Swinton, it's her sister, I guess. I wonder how Flash is doing. Oh no. Hmm? Oh, no. No. Is that Flash's car? Oh, no. What is he doing here at this hour? Oh, the music. Is he here to see me? Wait, why is he speeding towards me? Oh, no. No, no. No! Oh no! Oh! I mean, as far as car crashes go, that didn't sound as bad as it could be. Farewell, Swinton. You never should have taken what was mine. Oh no. Apparently she pissed off Dr. Claw. Is it Dr. Claw? Or is it just the Claw? The guy from Inspector Gadget. You know. I'll get you next time, Gadget. Him? No? Maybe? All right. Well, anyway. <clears throat> Need to clear my throat after that one. But that's fine. I'll have plenty of time to do that between episodes. 
and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye, good night, and good luck.